a couple of things that are interesting in your purview because you also have good contacts with the Bears, and that's the primary rival in that division. Mitch Trubisky, by the way, looked great uh, for Buffalo, and uh, the Andy Dalton, uh, Andy Dalton situation is a bit of a mess because the offensive line's in a total rebuild. I blame Ryan Pace, the GM, who um, the, I have two people in Chicago who I lean in, two reporters I lean on, and both just just don't think he's terribly smart. They really don't. They, they, I mean, if you go look at their draft picks, there's a lot of misses, uh, Trubisky being the primary one. Um, when, when, you were, when you cover a Packers-Bears game, you have all sorts of people that cover Chicago that you know as well. Um, I've always been a fan of Matt Nagy, but boy, when you watch – Buffalo play Chicago. Buffalo is simply more crisp. They're more efficient. Um, how much of the Chicago mess is Matt Nagy? I think plenty. I, I think that he, he doesn't really seem to have his finger on the pulse of the, the, the position we really thought he did. He, even obviously Trubisky is a, a mistake. I mean, goes without saying, but to pull him when they did last season, kind of strange, kind of early. And then to ride out Nick Foles as long as they did when, you know, getting the ball past midfield was an odyssey for this offense. And, and the only reason they go back to Trubisky is because Foles gets hurt. They sneak into the playoffs. They keep their jobs. It was just a bizarre, strange year. And I think that's why they had the offseason they had. I tried to really get to the bottom of their their hunt for a quarterback this offseason. Between him and Ryan Pace, I mean, they knew they were lucky to have their jobs. Like, you know, wins over what Houston and Jacksonville saved their jobs. They had to get a quarterback and they tried everything. I mean, they really thought they were going to have a shot at Watson. They really, they, they, Ben Roethlisberger was in the picture. Somebody told me they they probably placed a call to the Packers for Aaron Rodgers. They were trying everything. And Russell Wilson, they really thought they had that deal done. Like that was close. They didn't get Russell Wilson. So they end up with Justin Fields in a roundabout way. Signing Dalton allows them to not get, you know, hit up too bad for draft picks when they had to move up to take fields because they can kind of sell Dalton to an extent better than you can sell Foles. Um, but trust me, they tried everybody this offseason, everybody. Um, what is your gut feeling? I I do think Dalton will start the first week. I think there's been a promise made behind the scenes. In fact, somebody I know that is a pretty – He's close to the organization. He, he's he's told me on a couple occasions there's kind of a, a handshake agreement, kind of an understand understanding Dalton starts in week one. That's my take. Um, if, if I said to you, when does Justin Fields play? When would be your guess? I've heard similar things, too, that Andy Dalton, and you heard it from him, too, this is my time, but at the end, end of the day you are what you are we all saw that performance against buffalo it was it was ugly i mean this is what andy dalton is at this point i think he probably starts and loses you know a game two games and they have no choice but to go to justin fields i don't see how you can just roll with andy dalton for for too long when you take a justin fields and everybody in the city wants him to play people in the locker room are going to want him to play that's really who you're trying to win over teammates in the locker if you can get veterans to believe that justin fields is, is the answer quarterback i think that's probably when they make the move and if andy dalton goes out there throws a couple of picks looks like the same player we've seen you know good never great you have to take a shot at, at great it is interesting though colin i mean what a great move for uh, ryan pace and Meg in terms of survival they probably would love to wait to play justin fields because the longer you wait the longer you can sell the future to ownership and say, all right, no, we, we drafted this guy. He'll be ready one day. He's our guy. Just believe us. So good move of survival to go with the rookie as opposed to a veteran or someone else. Um, but I, I think everybody should be on the clock there in management. I'm pretty shocked that they all kept their jobs. I think a lot of them were shocked that they kept their jobs. Mm -hmm. 